Okay. All of the, uh, <coughs> the Discord stuff is out. Ah, oh, crap. Twitch wants me to update it. Just a second. I'm sorry if you're messaging. I, I can't see anything right now. Um, okay, it's almost done. There we go. Man, I haven't been on the channel in like almost two months. That's kind of weird. But, uh, <clears throat> I, uh, I'm back now. At least for tonight. I don't know what any of these profiles are for, so we're just gonna start on 22. And, uh, yeah. Challenge run of today. Do not attack ever. Or you die. Stream working all good? Let me just check. Yeah, it is. My mic is good enough, my stream footage is good enough, and I even have a webcam now. Look at that. Okay, so. Uh, <clears throat> so you may be wondering how on earth we're gonna do this given we can't attack. That's a very good question. How are we going to level up? Well, to, uh, oh, I want to customize it, but we don't have a whole lot of stuff. No sword. I don't know. I can't come up with anything clever. leave them like this. But, um, yeah, you may be wondering how we're gonna level up. We're not, at least for a bit. So, uh, <clears throat> just to define what I mean by no attacking, and this is not gonna count because it's me defining what it means. Uh, all primary attacks are banned, so none of this garbage. And any, any uh, character's active skills that are capable of inflicting damage are banned. So if you use charge just for mobility and you don't hit anything, too bad. Can't do that. Also, hot damn, level 1 charge is terrible. But, uh, yeah. That's, that's the main rules. No primaries, no offensive offensive, potentially uh, active skills, and all, all, um, all active skills that are not capable of inflicting damage are, uh, are perfectly acceptable, such as Lay on Hands, and all passive skills are also perfectly acceptable. So we could get the shield, we could get the stunning blows, or we could get Flames of Devotion. Of course, that and that aren't going to do anything because we can't use the sword. So, while every passive is available, a lot of them aren't going to matter. And I'm starting off with Paladin, obviously, because none of the five starting characters can do anything. Like, you have Paladin, you, you have with the sword and the dash, you have Ranger with the bow and the, the, the spinnies, spinny arrows. You have Sorcerer with the Ice Skulls and the Comet, and you have Warlock with the Dagger and the Lightning Bolt. <laughs> and you have Witch Hunter with the Crossbow and the Hounds. None of these skills are allowed, so we're picking Paladin because he has the most health and the most armor. So, uh, for Phase 1 of this challenge, we have to collect resources. Quite a lot of resources, I might add. While also not killing anything. Ah. This is going to be very difficult. So now we have the miner. Ah. Ow. 
And I'm just gonna go ahead and send this down, because I don't trust myself to last long enough. Yeah, actually, you guys can go ahead and finish me off. We're, we're gonna be taking a lot of deaths here. So four ore. We're gonna need to slowly work our way up. There we go, that's good. You like to see it? Is that a mine up there? Is it a mine shaft? Oh, it is. Okay, so we have to be careful not to bait any enemies, if at all possible. It looks like that is largely not going to be possible. Maybe I can, like, swing them around this way, but I also don't want to get caught. See, the, the main dilemma here is I don't want this to take a million years, but I also don't want to die. I think we're just gonna have to go with this. I don't, uh, I don't trust myself to do much more than this. Go ahead, eat me. So, the challenge is gonna be just this for a while. Until we can get some extra, uh, utility. We've been really, really, uh, lucky with the, uh, with the the elevator generations, I gotta say. I'm surprised that every single time we've had one appear so close. It's very reassuring. Oh, and also, obviously, items are allowed to, and that's gonna be the main way of how we get our damage in, is through items. Passive damaging items. We can't even get EXP from trap kills. I mean, I already knew that was the case, but I felt like just highlighting it. In case of uh, somebody didn't know. But yeah, you uh, you cannot get EXP from traps. Because you are not the one doing the killing. If you see here... Uh, uh, it doesn't even say. There's no stat that says enemies killed because we haven't done any, anything yet. We haven't done any of that. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and send this money. And we'll just uh, take the quick path out of this and return to town. Hopefully we get some more ore soon, that'd be swell. That's a blood right. You. Although, it may be worth my while to grab it, just for the uh, achievement progress it will provide. Blood Rite of the Crone. Cool, that doesn't help at all, to any extent. I'm not dead yet! Oh, I'm dead now. <laughs> uh, so yeah, this, uh, this first part is going to be very RNG heavy. I haven't quite routed out what I want to do yet. I think I think I have a general idea. Um, so th there's a couple of ways we can go about doing this. One of them is slightly longer to get going, but slightly more like safe. So the the two real options. That also, there's a mine shaft there, so I gotta be I gotta try to book it over to there. So the two kind of like main options we have. Oh god, have I made a mistake? Do I want to go for this money? I don't think so. I don't think I can. I don't think I can afford to. Ah, there was ore over there. Oh, that hurts. That's okay. So, the one route we could take... Hey, Joker, what's going on? I'm trying to be Heroes of Hammerwatch without attacking because I thought it would be funny. I, uh, I'm, I'm dead. I, can, I can't do anything. <laughs> Thanks, I love it too. I had to, I had to get a webcam for school because some of, uh, some of our exams required, required you to show your webcam to prove that you were not cheating. And, uh, I didn't have one, so I had to go get one. Ow. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. 
I remember you. Don't worry, I didn't forget. Oh, oh god. Please, Ow. let me out. We're just gonna bank the money. Just bank it and leave. <laughs> we really need ore. Yeah, as I was saying, our, our two main paths, the, the less safe one is to get the shop, then every time we gotta try and roll spiked boots, because, well, I, it doesn't have to be spiked boots, but that's pretty much, like, one of the only passive damage items we'll have for a while. The next, obviously, being Cape of the Flamewalker, which is also going to be very helpful. Bro, what? Please. Oh, yes. Let me out. <laughs> oh, man, this is so dumb. Or, uh, the other path is we go to unlock Priest, and then we we rush the guild hall, so that way we can get the passive damaging lasers. Which is obviously a lot more consistent, but will take a lot more of this to get finished. Because, uh, until we have a, a, uh, a means of passively damaging enemies, we are unable to gain any levels. Because, <clears throat> because, uh, as I said before, you might have heard, but, uh, trap deaths do not give us experience, because we are not the ones responsible for the enemy's demise. It is their own fault, and we are not rewarded as a result. This is going to be a, a very mobility-heavy task at the start, because I have to bait all these enemies around. If there isn't a mine, or like, uh, like an elevator here, I, uh, oh, there we go. There's one. Well, that's some good profit. <gasps> it's not gonna be anything until I can get some more ore, though. Hey, two curbs. I thought it was an interesting idea, too, or at the very least, I thought it would be funny to watch. It definitely adds some spiciness to a fresh profile play. Oh my god, it's an ore! Okay, I have to not choke. This is... this could be it. This could be my moment. Okay, now we need to find a mineshaft. Oh god! Okay, please, please, mineshaft. Ah! Alright, alright, it's fine, it's fine. We're gonna... we're gonna kill them all. Ah! Ah! Please, please, please. Okay. No! Oh, uh, they're gonna get me. Oh, oh no! Ah, <laughs> oh, crap. Well, I blew that opportunity. Or maybe there just wasn't a mine shaft to begin with. Okay, this is a good start. We have a mine shaft right here. Or an elevator, I guess. The whole thing is a mine shaft. I keep forgetting that. Yeah, uh, I'm not sure what route I should take yet. I haven't really like thought about this very much. All I knew is, all I know is that Priest is the eventual character we're gonna we're gonna be finishing with because playing as basically anyone else would be pure torture. I don't want to risk it, but I kind of... No, I can't. You gotta take the small victories as they come. Tell you why what? Tell you why I remember you? Because you came to my streams a lot? Oh, jeez. Uh-oh. We gotta use that little... Puny, puny 45 degree shield that the paladin actually starts with. Fun fact, the paladin starts with a shield. 
like before you even have a rank in it, he just has one. It's not very good, but it's there. Okay, we got our fifth ore. Now we gotta book it for a for a mine shaft, hopefully. Uh oh. Oh, I don't like the look of this. Yo, I think this is actually bad. Okay, hang on. Maybe I can, like, bait them in here. Like, like bait them and then run around them. Oh, look at that. Oh, crap, there's another one. This is, uh... This is certainly gonna be an interesting task. Okay, go, 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 go! Run, 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 run! Alright, I made it out. I'm alive! Uh... Run! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. How am I not dead? Please. Oh! <laughs> the clutchest mine shaft I've ever seen. Elevator. Uh, what triggers the priest unlock? The buying the chapel for 10 grand. Right now, I have 1,800. Or no, or no, 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 um, no, actually... You buy the chapel with ore, but you don't have to purchase the first thing in the chapel. Okay, so with that being said, I think... I think we're gonna want to start with ore trader here, because... As we can tell, getting money is a lot more consistent than getting ore. So I think the play is to start off with ore trader. Blacksmith does next to nothing to it for us to start. So I think ore trader is our first choice. As for why I got this idea, I have no idea. I thought it would be funny. That's really the extent of it, is... Man, wouldn't that be hilarious. And then I just did it. Okay, there we go. <laughs> We're making progress! The, uh, the early game is definitely gonna be the worst part of this. Once we actually get a priest with the... with the last passive, we're gonna be able to start rolling stuff a little bit more. But for now, it's like, oh, are we gonna get resources and a mineshaft to deposit them in? I sure hope so. to read your message, but I want to find a shaft. Please. Please, game. Please, game. I'm very grateful that there hasn't been very many enemies, but can you please give me a mine shaft, an elevator? Thank you. That is four more ore. Yes. And we got dispatchers. Did I... Did you, I don't know, thought of that run by any chance? Uh, the common consensus is that it's an orange. It could be a pumpkin. Either way, if it's... If it's food sitting on a floor, you probably shouldn't eat it, but... We don't seem to care. Okay, so the next thing we want is Town Hall, obviously. And... There we go, Chapel. This is how we get Priest. But, the act of getting priest isn't going to mean very much with a- No, you know what? Actually, we are gonna have to go the shop route. Because getting priest on its own doesn't mean anything. You need priest, and you need a way for the priest to kill things for him to level up. So yeah, we are gonna have to go with the shop route. You don't want to finish that run because it's probably TAS only. So my goal is to, like, the first- Oh, no, 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 my friend! We are going all the way. Not in one stream, because that would be insane. But, I am taking this shit all the way to the end. We are beating Thunder Snow as someone. Probably the priest. Ah, 
I'm going full meme on this shit and we're doing the entire game. I think this was a mistake. Oh. It apparently was not. I'm very happy about that. Should I risk it for the biscuit? I'm not gonna. There's nothing over there. So just give me my one ore and I'll leave. I'll leave happily. Yes. There we go. How to get Kelly to hate you? Well, Kelly would only hate me if I made a, if I made her play along with me. Honestly, I think one of the biggest difficulties of this challenge is gonna be not just accidentally attacking something. I mean, so far I've had it pretty, uh, pretty locked into my brain. But what if that does not continue? Oh, I have another. Uh, I have another idea for how we could get the priest up to the to the lasers. So obviously we need guild hall level four in order to even like have the ability to purchase it. But but we could get the ten stars from. This is absolutely terrible, by the way. I don't think we're gonna make it out of this one. No. <laughs> uh, but we're gonna. We could get, like, the, uh, the guild hall up to level 4, and then if we have enough, uh, enough of this. If we get this up to the, to the 4th rank, we'll have 12 stars accumulated, and we can purchase the, uh, the priest last passive immediately. Otherwise, we're gonna have to go with the shop route, which, uh, isn't going to be particularly easy. This is gonna be bad. Oh! It's over there! How do I get to it? It looks like- it looks like I gotta go this way. I sure hope that that's right. Otherwise, I'm just dead. Oh yeah, I know it. I know it's gonna be forever. Uh-oh. I've made a fatal mistake. Perhaps I can get myself out of it. Okay. So far, so good. Watch out for the melee enemies, because you can... It seems you can push aside the maggots a little bit more than you can push aside the ticks. Alright. Alright. We're still here. It's alright, we can tank it. There we go, there we go. There's another ore down there. Guess how much I care. Guess how much I care. The answer is I don't know. We're taking the one ore that we got. Cool, we have three ore and like halfway to another one. <sighs> hey, that's funny. That's good. Oh! There's a mine shaft. An elevator. And oh god. And there's an ore over there. So that's extra good. <laughs> oh, I didn't say it was a good idea. This is definitely not a uh, play-along-at-home sort of idea. Y you would have to be, like, legitimately insane to try this. I can't do it. I'm gonna die if I go for that ore. It's alright, it's alright. We got our loot, we're gonna head out. And the bats aren't gonna get me because I'm, I'm always moving, and they're not gonna get me. Yes! Excellent. <gasps> I would rather you finish on stream Hammerwatch 1. Hammerwatch 1 doesn't take that long to finish. I actually finished Hammerwatch 1 once. It only takes a couple hours. Probably a lot less if you, like, remember the layout of the map. <clears throat> okay, mineshaft. Elevator. I'm just gonna say mineshaft, like, 
inherently now because that's just easier for me to remember. I feel like we're uh, we're not gonna get very far with this one unless if there's like some more loot. This helps, of course, but it's still uh, not very much. Oh, there's something. Well, here's something. There we go. That's good. Don't get walled in. That's okay. Ah, uh, that's a spawner. That's gonna be really dangerous. I think I'll just take this and head out. It's okay. We're gonna get it eventually. Excellent. Vol easy, just get pet. <laughs> I, <laughs> you know. I never considered the possibility of spending 25 grand on something that can only grab loot for me that's close by. Oh, here we go. Ah. Oh, I can uh, I can kill enemies in in here with the arrows. Yo, now this is gaming. This is strategy. And then I walk directly into the enemy. Good job. Just kill the enemies off. Please. I can handle with... I can deal with a singular bat. That's okay. I'm probably gonna die anyway. Oh, hey, look, it's money. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna take the L in this one. an ore. Let's go. Now, where's the elevator? And how much crap will I have to navigate through to get to it? I don't know if this is the case, but it, there, it seems like there's been an elevator on every first floor so far. If that is how this works, I'm, like, extremely grateful for that. Like, not only is that polite game design, but th that's gonna, like, reduce the level of RNG needed to finish this. Yeah, we're just gonna, we're just gonna take it. <laughs> I don't feel like getting any more. Yes. Yes. Oh. Restart. Anything else I feel like yes give me give me it all right there we go good enough for me you look at that I have six rocks now and enough money to buy another one okay what else do we need um 
fountain fountain won't really do anything. So we need we need guild hall. I'm kind of tempted to buy treasury at some point. I don't know how much that'll matter. But we definitely want ore trader. I think that's going to be the next one I, I, I go for, is Ore Trader. Fountain will give me a bit of extra money, but the you see, the thing is, is that the Tier 1 Fountain doesn't have all that much on it. All of the, all of the spicy stuff is in the Fountain Tier 2. So, uh, I think that the, the play is we're going to go Ore Trader first. And then we might try to build into the store and the guild hall. Hopefully get the chapel eventually. But yeah, or or trader is definitely like first goal. Because whenever we can make these ore rates better, the more we can improve the ore rates, the more we can get the uh, the other buildings up quicker. Or if we could just find more ore, that would also help. I'd be extremely down for just finding more ore. Uh, is, this, is this worth it? I don't, I don't think it's worth it. This is worth it though, right? You just gotta be a gamer. Alright, there we go. Beeline. Beeline. There's some fruit. Uh oh. Oh jeez. Ah! Ugh. Okay. Well, there's an ore! Can we get it in time? Dude, is there no mine? Or is there no elevator here? Ah, oh, shit! There isn't, so I'm gonna have to go to the next floor! To try and find one. Oh man, now I got a lot riding on this. Yo, actually, actually. Okay, now we got a potion. Oh, and there's the there's the uh, the elevator. Uh oh. Uh oh. Go! Okay, there we go. So now we've unlocked the potion, and as you may know, potions are not weapons. Therefore, I have unlimited permanent access to this one potion for a while. Isn't that great? Ow. That's like 50 extra health that I get. Yo, and there's an ore. Oh, jeez. This is going to be a little bit. There's a lot in this one. Oh, I'm gonna have to go, like, in for it. There we go. I'm alive. Give me the orange. Give me the orange pumpkin. I'm just gonna take it. Potions can get you some achievement. You're right. You are correct. G great, great point. I will, I will be sure to do that. In addition to providing me with useful skill stars, the achievements also will provide me with more ore and money, which means less work I have to do. Ow. Yo, you ready? We're gonna we're gonna try and we're gonna try and oh, that's not what I was gonna try and do. I was gonna try and smack them into the, the rocks. Probably no wells in floor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I think there are. There just aren't any before you get the potion. Oh! Uh, monoliths, too. Monoliths give achievements. Gold fever! Let's go! And then watch me freaking die immediately. Gold fever, the, like, only one that matters. Other than maybe like health regen, be nice. Do I go for more loot? Am I gamer enough? I'm not. I'm. I'm gonna 
step down. We're gonna pop our potion for that sweet achievement progress. And we're gonna send down this one alright man. Let's go. <laughs> Okay, ten or ten or we can get the uh, the next war trader now. Yes, excellent. Now it only takes twelve hundred and fifty, right? That's how much it is. Yeah. Okay, so next up. I think we're we might want to try to get the uh, the item shop. So that way, if we find spiked boots, we can get it, and then we can start killing some things, which will not only let me level up and survive for longer than sixty seconds, but it'll also give me different achievements. There we go. There are there are wells. Look at that. Look at that! Look at that spiciness right there. We're gonna pop the other potion. And I, I guess we're going to the next floor. I know that's also an achievement too, is uh, reach X number of new floors. There's like all these different things I'm keeping a tab on. Well, of course I want to kill things eventually. How else am I going to finish the video game? Uh-oh. This could be a problem. This could be a real big problem. Oh, it's not. It's not. I'm, I'm going to be greedy, and I'm probably going to regret it, but we're going to go. We're going to go for it. Go! Go, 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 go! Okay, 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 let's go. Ow. I don't have a lot of hits left. Oh, I shouldn't have done it. I shouldn't have done it. I don't think I would have made it there anyway, but uh. Now you see, actually, I did try that before. I tried like a, uh, a pacifist run. And if you're not doing the uh, if you're not doing the cubes, because I think the cubes count as kills, actually. So, if you're not doing the, the portals, the absolute minimum you can get the kills down, the kills down to, was like 30-something. Because each statue in Act 3 counts as a kill. So I guess you could portal past Act 3 and then, uh... You could portal past Act 3 to get rid of some of the kills, but... There were a lot of other problems, like Act 5 was ridiculous, Act 6 was even worse. Act 6 was like borderline impossible. Uh, yeah, I'll just send it. It's going to make me feel comfortable that way. Imagine a secret path. <laughs> hey, uh, devs, can you patch in a way for me to beat the game without killing anything, please? I need it for content. Oh, let's go. All of the money, none of the damage. I, I, want, I do want to be taking a bit of damage, though. We gotta get those achievements going. Pretty much like any achievement I can manage, I should try and go for. There we go, damage, let's go. Damage. And another elevator usage. And more money. A little bit more money. Yeah. Pop the potion. Send it. Oh. Excellent. How are we doing for uh, achievements? Accomplishments? 
We have the gulp 50 potions, we have to use 25 wells, and that'll only give 500. Uh, heal 1,000 by pickups, heal 10,000 health, uh, reach 50 new- oh, there we go, there we go, we're gonna get that, we're gonna get that eventually, we're gonna get these eventually, we're gonna get that, oh, dispatcher 2, oh, that's a lot, that's a lot of points. Uh, yeah, Ancient Powers is Monoliths and Blood Rites. Those are good. Builders, Builders, we're gonna get some progress with that. And Big Spenders, when we spend money to convert to ore. And, uh, Looting Chests is gonna help a little. The, the main ones we want to focus on, these were just gonna happen passively. But Blood Rites, Ancient Powers, and then, um... I get all of these are gonna happen too. But yeah, the ones that we can control are the potions. So, the next plan, I think, is... This is gonna let us get an uncommon item, and we could... We could roll the uncommon item until it is spiked boots. Because, uh, that seems like the most efficient way, <laughs> unfortunately. Or we could just go insane with achievements. And then hopefully get up to, uh, the fourth rank just from that. Yeah, we can't even use, like, the tavern to gamble because we're not gonna be able to get the tavern for a while. Oh man, incredible strength. Best monolith in the game, am I right, fellas? How on earth am I gonna get through this? They're just gonna body me. They're just gonna trap me in here and body me. Not if I completely avoid them, they're not. I don't know how that works, but alright. I guess we're gonna go this way? Oh. Some more money. Ooh. Oh man. Dude, I have like jukes for days. Hell yeah, let's get the like 27 ah. money that was there. There's a well. I can see the glow. Pop a potion. Use the well. Then we can pop another potion later. Uh, oh, there, there's the elevator. That's good. That's good. Do you like to see it? Uh, we have to navigate our way there still, though. That could be hard. That could be extremely hard. Or not. Okay, or not. Let's go. Let's go. I'm not gonna risk it, dude. We're just gonna take it. If I was to go get that ore, I would definitely die. There we go. Three ore. We need ten. This is, uh, this is not gonna go well. Ow. Well, maybe it will, because I can smack them all on the rocks. So this room Ow. is a blessing. Yes! I've evaded everything. Greater insight. Hell yes! Experience gain! 
my favorite when I can't kill literally anything. It's times like this when you know the game's gotta be fucking with you. There we go, excellent. We got like 290 more money. Oh, that's good, that's good, that's good. There's a well, and there's an elevator. Ouch. Oh. Oh. Should I risk it? There's not a whole lot of melee guys on me right now. I kind of want to at least to see. Oh, two or Oh, I gotta get that. I like, I'm basically required to get it. There's enough space for me to avoid them all, right? You just gotta be good. Ow. Unlike that, I think Ow. I'm literally dead. Oh, yo, you know what else? Forget I've been forgetting about these. I've been forgetting that those exist. You hit me. Apothe- Oh my god, the first item I've been able to use. Apothecary herbs. Run like the wind. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna leave. Man, I completely forgot I still had that emote. I have another one too, I think. I have, um, I have that one and then I have this one. The other one is a, is a better meme emote, though. Very meme worthy. So, uh, this is one hell of a large group of enemies to be kiting around the map. Oh, pardon me, I'm receiving a phone call. everyone's day. I I just got back from uh, working at the grocery store. And I have to work again tomorrow morning. So I'm not going to be able to stream for a really long time. But I can still probably go for another like two hours anyway. Which is probably how long I would go regardless. Dude, I am like Dead to the 20th degree. <laughs> How old am I? I just turned 19 a couple weeks ago. My birthday was on the 2nd. I don't look 19, I get that a lot. Do I look older or younger? 
I usually don't get that I look younger, but... Yeah, older, that's what I thought. I get that a lot. I bet people think I was like... 18 to 20 when I was like 12. And I was like, okay, I'm not that old looking. Like, a couple of years, sure, but, like, an extra five or six? Oh. I don't think so. We're gonna go eat the food. And then we're gonna go down here. And it's probably gonna be a dead end. Oh. Dude, I, I was... I was kidding! Alright, well... There's, a, there's an elevator over there. So it's no biggie. Unless if I make it into a biggie. I'm like 26 when I shave people ask me for ID for beer. I think there was another there was another guy in my uh, high school where he he looked really young compared to how old he actually was, and uh, and we gave him the like class award for most likely to get ID to the bar. Why did I do that? I should have deposited. What am I doing? Ah. Uh... I was gonna like, I was gonna be like, I'm gonna go deposit it. No, what if there's something over there? There was not. I should just be really, really like safe about this. Like if you have any substantial amount of money, just deposit it. Ah. Which actually might be applicable to real life too now that I think about it. Don't gamble, just deposit. Or otherwise, you're gonna get infested by a bunch of insects, and they're gonna screw you out of your money. Or not. That's cool, too. That. Now, we're, we're just leaving. I, I... No, I don't care. Dude, I don't care. We're getting it, and we're leaving. <laughs> It was like two to three oars. I know, that's why it was so painful. It's okay, we're at five. We're halfway there. We're halfway there. To the next building. Ooh! Dude, and there's like no enemies in the- oh, never mind. There's still like almost no enemies. Ah! It's okay, it's okay. We're gonna get this. And I can I can keep going. We still got our potion and we still got we still got um the uh, the elevator is really like out in the open, so that's not gonna be an issue. Uh probably don't wanna go that way. Oh, oh yeah! Freaking let's go! Three ore. Three ore! I'm gonna deposit now, I don't trust myself. Three ore. Three ore. Let's go. Now we're gonna be at nine ore. Oh, let's go! Okay, all right, we need one more, and then we can get the shop, and then, and then, you won't believe it, you really won't, but after we get the shop, we can actually start inflicting damage on things. I know, right? What an idea. Inflicting damage in a roguelike game? I'm gonna die. <laughs> I'm so dead. I'm not? Okay. I don't understand, but I'll gracefully accept this gift I've been given. Oh, oh, oh let's go! Alright, here we go. 
Oh my god. That was really close. I got down to four health there. I just looked back on the on the footage. I got down to four health. Alright. General Store 2. Let's go! Ladies and gentlemen, we've done it. We can now, depending on what item is it, okay, it's not. We're just gonna have to... Oh yeah, that's not how this works, is it? You have to go like... It's not slash kill, is it just kill? Okay. It's slash kill in Minecraft, not here's I ever watch. Okay, so... This is how we're gonna roll the shot. This is how you used to roll the shot back in the day. You'd open up the command prompt, suicide, and then you'd you'd go you'd go back, and uh, there you go. You're gonna be back later. I can guarantee you, I will still be doing this. I I don't know if we have enough money right now. Actually, I don't know how much the boots are. Uh, but, uh, yeah, we're gonna, we're just gonna go get some more resources. And if we happen to have the boots in store, then we're gonna utilize that opportunity fully. As opposed to rolling for it, which, now that I think about it, will take ages. If you know me, you know that I extremely lack patience. I'm not gonna do that kind of crap. Unless if it's like 100% necessary. Uh, what do we got? We got money. There better be like something here. Okay, there's a little bit. Man, look at the bats. They're just like forming a ring. A ring of, of seeking death. You know, another thing that might help is actually some movement speed. Of course, that would require the, uh, the blacksmith. Ah! Oh, I got caught! Oh, fuck. I got caught. I got greedy. I'm gonna, like, artificially double the length of this challenge by not being smart. Well, that's good. That's not. I hate it. I hate it. Can you stop? Okay, there we go. Ah. Ah. Okay. I'm, I'm almost certainly going to die. Like, the, there, there was no, uh, no way around that. Okay. Good. Well, that's good. That's good. That's real good. That's real good. Give me some of that. Mmm! Four juicy diamonds. Okay, that is way too much crap for me to deal with, so uh, yeah, we're just gonna leave. I don't, I don't even feel bad, we're just gonna leave. We won't be able to open these either, I just realized. We won't be able to open those either, because those require, uh... Require attacking. Unless if there's like an item that lets you, I don't I don't think there is though. I think if you get the enemies to shoot at it, that will work. Oh, that's good. 
Oh, there's ore over there. We gotta get it. We gotta get it. We gotta get the ore. The ore is infinitely more valuable than the coins. He says as he goes for coins and then literally dies. Let's go. Zero IQ plays. Yo, can I, like, have the spike boots? That'd be real swell. Nope. I mean, I guess when you only have one green item per store, it's a little bit hard. So, uh, fair enough, I guess. I sure hope this is funny, because I'm, I'm gonna be, like, in this part of the game for freaking forever. Like, I've already been doing this for almost an hour, and I'm still nowhere near being done. Hit me. Ah. There we go. Ah! There's a mine shaft. Mine shaft elevator. And we're, we're gonna take it. We're gonna get bit. Send it. Oh, I wanted to use the potion. Oh well, I still sent it. It's all that matters to me. We're gonna do this slowly, one piece at a time. That's good. That's real good. Okay, this is fine. That's that's okay. This is still manageable. Okay, it's like going into, it's approaching unman, it's, it's now borderlining unmanageable territory. And uh, with this, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say uh, that I'm gonna head out. But there's a monolith there, so I do want to try and get that. If I can. I won't. Almost certainly. Yo, he's done it. Okay, kill me. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, I wonder how long it's gonna be till I get the uh, take a break glitch to happen. So I just realized I'm loading a lot of floors. That glitch is uh, bound to happen eventually. Well, we got a whole lot of safe money. That's nice. That's really handy. That's good. Yes. Excellent. And we're just gonna take it. I'm not even gonna take the risk. I literally don't care. I don't care if this takes all night for me to finish the- There we go! Explorers! And there's both a well and an elevator. So now all we need are some resources. That's good. That's good too, I wanna get some of that. Give me some of that sweet action, oh jeez. Okay, I'll take this. It's here. Oh jeez. And it's at this point when you, you question what everything is worth and you're like, okay, let's just go for the mine. Let's just go for the elevator. It is totally acceptable that I just wimp out and do this. Then we can get the well, and then use the potion, and die. Okay, what other things are there? Is there things for, like, taking damage? That's not a thing, is it? I know there's things for blocking damage. Yeah, there's not a... there's not a thing for taking damage, unfortunately. 39 ore. 33 elevators. That's gonna be really good. 
explorers, that'll happen eventually. <laughs> These will also hopefully happen eventually. Can I, can I get the spike boots? Can I? Nope. It's probably like a 2% chance that they're there. Or something like that. I don't know exactly how many uncommon items there are, but it's not as many as I'd like it to be. Or, or it's more than I'd like it to be, rather. When we when we upgrade the shop again, it's going to be a little bit easier because I'm going to have two uncommon slots. So hopefully that'll uh, make things a little bit more manageable when we're trying to eventually roll for that item. Let me out! Let me out! Okay, there we go. Let's go! This is looking real dangerous. Ah, here we go. There we go. That's it. That's it. That's all we're doing. Step by step, I shall conquer this seemingly impossible task. Oh. Dude, I've never been ha so happy to see a singular ore in my entire life. Okay, one enemy. We can... we can... We can handle one enemy. It's a little bit more than one, but uh, we can still handle it. There's enough space in here. There's not, like, comfortably a lot of space, but there's still space. Oh, jeez. Well, we're going in for it now. I'm committed. Oh, jeez. Please. Please give me an elevator. There we go. Excellent. So you gotta, you gotta take the small victories. Seven or. We are getting there. Dude, I don't even know what I want to buy next. What am I, like, trying to plan here? Ah. I could, um... What could I do? Because I already got general stuff. Oh, jeez. Okay, yeah, no, they're, they're, they're coming at me too hard. We gotta, oh. gotta take the one or we've been blessed with. trying to get now we don't really need apothecary that badly because the current potion kind of does everything that I that I'm gonna need I think guild hall might be what I want there's also a uh, treasury town hall but yeah I think guild hall guild hall is, an is another step or we can just rush the store that might be a thing to consider. I don't know yet. I haven't thought it, thought it out yet. It also depends on how much longer I'm gonna be doing this for. Like the, the first part of the plan. I feel like that that's way too dangerous. Unfortunately, we're gonna have to wuss out with just 80 coins. Unfortunate. <clears throat> okay. You've gotta be kidding me. This is way too much shit to handle. 
dude, how am I not dead? How on earth was I not even- Okay, there we go. I've, I've been damaged quite a bit. I've been damaged considerably. Shouldn't have said anything. Alright. Alright, I got it. I just get to get the money and leave. Please, 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 Spike Boots. Please. No. You know what? We're going for it. I think that it's worth it. Because if we can kill things, we can get so much more resources. No. I'm gonna slam my head against this until it works. You are going to give me the spike boots. If it's the last thing I ever do. Switch to Ranger to get the speed boost walking to the shop. Actually, I couldn't. <laughs> because A, I don't I wouldn't have any stars to purchase it, and B, that requires using a skill which I cannot do. <laughs> I mean you can use the roots. You wouldn't be wrong about that. That might actually be, like, a good idea at a certain point, but, uh, yeah. It requires using the ability and having the ability, both of which are a problem. Oh my god. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do this for a little bit more. And if I don't get it, we're gonna rush the uh we're gonna rush the next level of the shop. Nope. And I know I could re-roll it, but I have such limited funding that this is like actually more time efficient. Okay, we'll do 10 more tries, and then if we don't get it, I'm just gonna give up for now. One. That's one. Attempt number two with the lottery. Oh, oh, I can't, I can't, I can't in good faith. I can't in good faith. Because knowing me, I'll buy it, and there won't be any ore, and then I'll die instantly. I can't buy the pickaxe with in good faith. No. That's three. That's four. No. 
No. Five. The pickaxe would be a good investment if I could make it work a little bit more consistently. Because you'd essentially be paying 950 to get probably one more ore, which is a better deal than the uh, ore trader is currently giving me. But I still can't do it in good faith because there's no way I'm going to be able to make it work. Hmm. Okay, uh, one more, and then that's it. It's the last try, and we didn't get it. Okay, back to the mines it is. Oh, that's, that's really good. not too much here right now, although uh, that, that could certainly change very quickly. Yeah, you know what, I think we're just going to deposit this one ore. It makes, makes me feel more comfortable. I'd like to point out this is absolutely terrible RNG, and I hate it. Oh, that's good. Ow. For the, like, achievement, anyway. Okay, well, I, uh, I guess we're going to the next floor. Hey, look, an item. Was there not, like, a thing for finding secrets? I could have sworn that was one of the achievements. Yeah, there is. Detectives. That is a thing. So that'll definitely be, like, something to try and work towards as well. I've made a colossal mistake. And now I'm, like... Probably just dead. How? Literally how? How did I not actually die for that? I'm not even gonna get that much out of this run. But like, how on earth did I live that? One of these has to be it, right? Yeah! And then I'm gonna try and, uh... Keyword being try. I'm not actually gonna. Oh, maybe I am? I was just gonna try and go back to here. So that we can work on the achievements a bit. hold off on guild hall and I am gonna rush ore trader and uh, general market so we actually need 20 more not just 10 I can't help but check again to see if the, the boots are here they're not of course 
Well, I've gotten the pickaxe like four times. It's kind of insulting. I take personal offense to that. Alright. <laughs> you, you, know, you know something else? Like, it wouldn't make a difference anyway, but you can't even get health regeneration until you're able to kill something. Because your base health regen is absolute squat. And you can't get any until you level up, which requires killing things, which I cannot do. This could be, uh, this could be real bad. Oh yeah, it's extremely bad. Uh, do we take the ore? I don't think we can. <laughs> I don't think I could afford to. Alright. Full health again. Uh, let's not go there to start, because that looks scary. Granted, this doesn't look much better. That's okay. Are you really about to? Oh! Oh, clutch, clutch, clutch. Please, 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 please. Oh. <laughs> that was really scary. There we go. We got some more, uh, got some more gold. Plus one ore. Let's go. Why, why did I come up with this? This is one of those things where you're like, you're reasonably sure it can be done, but you sh just should not. Ow. Like, it's an extremely poor use of your Ow. time. Ah. But, I'm doing it for the meme, and when it comes to doing things for the meme, I'm fully committed. Ow. Okay, well, uh, there's a third ore. But I'm also dead, so I guess there's that. Uh, you know what would be really funny, actually? That I, like, I'm not gonna, but I could try, is... If I play Arena, and I get one of the items, that lets me kill enemies passively, like the Searing Sabatons or some crap like that. I could, like, grind resources in Arena. The only thing is, I don't know how long that would take to get. Or if it's even... I, I imagine it's possible, but I don't know if it would be a better use of time than this. Because the thing with Arena is that if you do not win, the entire time spent is for nothing. Whereas this, yes, it's an extremely small increments, but I can still make progress. Oh my god. Dude. What if the imp gives me like five ore? Oh, he gave me three! That's good enough! I'll take it! Oh, this run has been truly blessed. Alright, there we go. Three ore. Three entire pieces of stone. And we got the miner's achievement, so we're halfway to the first, uh, the first guild title. Hype. Uh, oh, there's a well. Okay. 
more achievement progress. Ah! This is ah! not great. That's okay. Just pop the potion. And take the well. Then, uh, do that. Then, um, die, question mark? This is, uh, not looking ideal. I'd love to get this money. I am, I'm astounded that not only was I not killed there, but I wasn't even hit. Crank up the rewards for me, aren't you? All right. Oh, there's there's a, there's an elevator. Ah. Okay, just play well. Play like a gamer. Don't care about the other about the other uh, money down there. Literally, do not care. Bank the two ore that we have. Sixteen ore. all these enemies because I can. This is going to be an extremely poor decision. Uh, it was not. I'm surprised. It was just a regularly poor decision, not an extremely poor decision. Oh geez. Well, it's certainly about to become an extremely poor decision. Or not. Okay, next floor. Let's go. I'm not getting out of that. So... Oh crap. Alright, we're on the move. Maybe like an exit would be cool? Why am I going for the money? I'm so dead. I'm actually so dead. Please. Please. Elevator. I've never needed one so bad. Well, oh that that's probably not true, but... Go! Okay. We've made it to the third floor. I don't know what to say. We're certainly not in a very good position. An elevator, like, immediately would be cool. I will take the compen compensate compensational? Is that a word? Compensational healing item? I'm, like, definitely dead. Like, 100% dead. <sighs> the door was right there. The door was right there. I could have made it. I could have banked it all. And then died at the boss fight. Hey! I'm gonna get 10 secrets eventually if we keep getting stuff like that. Ow. Alright. Whatever. Sometimes you just gotta take it. Ooh! Yes! Hey, you know what else? While it's extremely unlikely, I could get the spike boots from a secret. Or like a chest or something. It's even less likely to do that than it is to get them from the shop. But it's still not impossible. And that hope is enough for me to live on.
I think I'll just do that. Wow. Okay, there's not that many melee guys. I'm not gonna go into that tiny room, but we can handle this. This is enough space to move. And at this point, I quit and we're gonna get the, the, get the stuff banked. And I need to use the bathroom real quick. So I'll be back in a few minutes.
So we are back to the grind. The, the grind of being able to get somewhere. Hey, it's another die. Too bad that requires money to change up the die. Well, I, I think the first time it doesn't. So I could change my colors once. Uh oh. Alright, we're gonna kill him. Ah. Nineteen. We're almost there. I could also get the uh, the treasury upgrade, but I don't think that's gonna matter enough. I, I think I'd be better off just doing War Trader. Well, obviously first the uh, the town hall, and then town hall into War Trader. Yo, I like almost died. Let's go. That's pretty cool. Alright, well, that's about all I feel like doing. in uh, most circumstances of that question is yes. 
Am I just dead? If I go for this? I think I'm just dead. Yep. There's no way for me to push around them. Oh well. We got achievement progress. It was worth it. Still only halfway there. That's okay. Well, I could do this. Okay, that was it. Three, one, two, go. for that, at least not right now. Oh. Ah. Or I just could say fuck it and get it. And then leave. Oh. Oh. I didn't see any ele elevators, so... <sighs> see worth it, I guess? I don't know. Oh my goodness, I can inflict damage! Why well, better, like, take advantage of this? I can inflict damage with this! Not very, like, much damage, but I can inflict some. Oh, this is fantastic. What a day! I can inflict damage. Hopefully, uh, retaliation damage counts. I'm pretty sure it does. I know it counts for kills. Yes! Yo, I evaded it? How? I literally have no evasion. I don't have a Okay. Oh my god. Dude, I could level up off of this. Let's go. Why is he evading some of the hits? Why is he evading, like, a lot of the hits? Is this a glitch with this item? God, dude, I'm level two. I'm level two! Off of the frickin' Scarab of Protection. Yo, this is fantastic. Granted, I have a limited health pool for this to do anything, but... but this is amazing. I gotta, like, fully capitalize on this. can inflict damage. I've like wiped this floor out just by retaliation damage. Also, I am gonna send down my resources. Because I don't wanna lose them. Ah, screw it, I'll go get the other food. Let's get it. Yeah. 
He's evading like half these hits though. I don't understand why. Maybe, maybe like melee hits it does that? I don't know. But yeah, that's really weird. You could get really far with this. If you actually evade melee hits. This is like worth doing instead of spiked boots if it comes up. Hunter's knife! 20% more damage done to beasts! That's like what everything here is! What an amazing thing! Okay, well that's not so amazing. Okay, yeah, so it seems like projectile hits don't work for it, but melee hits do? I don't understand. But whatever the case may be, I intend to fully capitalize on it. Okay, maybe the whole evasion thing is... Got some freaking steak though, that's pretty cool. Ah. We got Revengers! Yo, and we're like gaining more levels. And we got Monster Pamphlet. Yo, this is like actually spectacular. Actually, unprecedented ma amounts of awesome. Unprecedented amounts of unprecedented amounts of gamer going on. But this is actually amazing. I'm gonna deposit because I don't trust myself. But this is incredible. Dispatchers too. We've ranked up. Oh man, now we're fucking getting places. Let's go! The man eaters definitely gonna murder me. I don't understand how this is working though. Cause like he isn't being hit. Like he is when it's like projectiles, but when it isn't, he just does not take damage. Dude, we're gonna get to the third floor and, like, have shit cleared out. This is unbelievable. This is actually unbelievable. Is there any ore down there? It doesn't look like it. I feel like that this item is not supposed to do that, but you know what? I'll take it, dude. If it was some sort of like weird error in the code, I'll take it for what it is. Ow, ah. Granted, it's still not perfect because like, all projectile damage is still damaging. But I'm am amazed this works at all. a lot of maggots, by the way. Oh my god.
Dude, we're gonna kill the mini bosses like this. How? How? I'm now at level three. I'm now at the third level of experience. Because I've been using fucking retaliation damage to kill things. And the beast thing is giving me, like, so much HP. Oh my god. I don't know what the hell happened with this, but I am ecstatic right now. Summon more dudes. Ow. Ah. Oh my god. Actually phenomenal. I've I've made it to the first boss. Because of the scarab. How or why, but it's happened. And I'm extremely grateful. I already got the uh, the item in here, right? Yeah. Forty-seven fifty guild points. And I could like hit level five with paladin like this too. If I did this for long enough. I assume that the golems thing is not gonna go over quite so well. Ah. Yeah, I didn't think so. Yo, I could kill him though if I like gave myself enough time to dodge. Screw it, I'm down. Let's try. Let's try. Oh, let's not get hit by that, though. That's not good. Oh. But here come the bats. And I evade their hits! Oh my god, this is actually incredible. I'm about to kill the golem without hitting him. He's gotta be careful. I don't know why the hell the freaking retaliation item works like this, but I swear I didn't do anything. It's just doing this on its own. I, I promise I did not do anything. Hopefully it, it works for the red bats as well. It does! Oh my god, no! Oh! We gotta be careful. Dude, this is pretty hype! I'm like super scared now. Cause I really don't want to mess this up. Oh my god, I did! <laughs> it fucking did it! I killed the golem using the freaking scarab of protection. Oh my god. I think that item is broken. I don't think it's supposed to do that. 
I do not think that they intended that that item does that. Oh my god. Yo, we are now in the second act. I don't belong here. I'm immediately gonna die, of course, but... Oh my god, maybe I won't. There's still enough melee damage and, like, healing sources that I could conceivably get further with this. Is yeah, the thing is, is that, like, hey, the skellies proc it too. So I can just sit- oh, okay. Only some of them. Ow. It doesn't seem to work all the time. I don't know why, but... Oh jeez. This could be real bad. Yo, I'm actually- I am actually hashtag blessed right now. There is absolutely no reason this should be working, and it is. And I love it. does it? I don't know, but <laughs> it's just like every time, or, or almost every time, it seems to be from certain enemies, that like every time a melee hit from certain enemies hits you, you just evade it every hit. Like, I don't know if the spikes kit ticks do it, but the regular ticks do it, the bats do it, and it is the, like, actually dumbest thing I've ever seen. Ah. Ah. Well, all good things must come to an end eventually. But that was absolutely phenomenal. I made so much progress. 30 ore and 7,000 gold. Oh my goodness. Okay. Now I have a choice, what do I want? I still think we gotta rush the shop. But that was amazing. I, I don't know what happened there. But I'm really happy it did. Oh, now we have, like, stuff to spend. We can upgrade our shield! Yes, dude, let's go! We have a better shield! Now we can buy some more ore. We can keep going. Now that I know that Scarab of Protection is that good, I want to check the shop for it now. Holy crap. That item is weird. I love it. Granted, it wasn't just the... It wasn't just the Scarab that made that work out so well, it was also- I mean, it's gonna be weird, I can't kill things now. Yo, I beat a boss. I can't believe it. I beat a boss and I didn't even, like, have anything really upgraded. I got the freaking Scarab of Protection, and that by itself- that were not by itself- that combined with the Hunter's Knife let me clear the first boss without attacking.
It's just like, that concept is so great. Well, now that our shield's upgraded, we have a chance to block some damage too, so that's good. That's pretty nice. That's pretty nifty, I would say. Man, at first I thought I was just going to be able to use it a few times to maybe level up once. I didn't know I was going to be able to utilize it to the point where I could freaking kill an entire boss with it. Now that's just great. Wow. Alright, well, uh, I guess we're going here. I have a lot riding on this one, so hopefully ah. I can manage. Not the checkers. I think I'll be okay. Ow. I hope I'll be ah. okay. Yeah, I got it. I'm, uh, definitely, like, prone to die soon, though. I can't really comfortably go that way, so we gotta try out something else. Oh, dear. I, uh, I think I might be dead. I think I might be dead here. Ow! Ow! Oh, not yet. You haven't killed me yet, game. I'm still in it to win it, even though I'm going to die. Go, 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 run. Please, elevator, something. Yes! Now we have, now we have 91 elf. I just love that. I just love that so much. I love that that worked. It had no right to work, and it did. Like, the item does not say it gives you evasion to anything, and yet every single time one of the ticks or bats would hit me, I would evade the hit but proc the, uh but proc the scarab anyway. I think I might just die. Yeah, I'm not gonna make that one. Alright, that's fine. It's hard to be in a bad mood after what just happened. Twenty-five ore and then we can uh, improve our shop, which will be pretty handy. Now I know, like, if you get the Scarab, you're just set for a while. <laughs> for at least the first couple of floors. Ah. I'm gonna... I'm totally gonna get screwed here, aren't I? Ow. The blocking damage is nice. Ow. I do appreciate that. It's now or never. Gamer time! Ah. Alright, there we go. Uh, down. Down, 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 down. Come on, baby. Uh oh. This, uh, this does not look promising. Oh. Never mind. It appears like there isn't 
a uh, elevator here, so I guess we gotta keep looking. Again, we have a lot riding in this one too. Three ore and a decent chunk of change. Let's hope we find it. Ah, ah, that's not it. That's not it either. That certainly also is not it. Nah, that's gonna kill me. Ugh. Oh, there we go. There we go, there we go, there we go. Let's go. Now if I can maneuver my way over to the, uh, the well, that'd be cool. Or not. That's fine. 22! We're getting really close. Then I can start with two uncommon items in the, in the shop. Maybe I'll get the, uh, the scarab and the spiked boots. Really? Alright. Well, there's something over there. I'm not gonna get that ore. I, I I feel like I'm definitely not gonna get that ore. So we're just gonna we're just gonna give up. There's another secret. Hell yeah. There's another war. You love to see it. Ah. Oh wait, what? I'm sorry, what? Oh, that was from the secret. I was like, when the hell did I get that ability? Oh. Literally like just a minute. Uh, this doesn't look very comforting. I'm gonna get killed if I go in either of these. Yeah, we're gonna have to... Gonna have to not. Wow! Okay. That was rude. Jeez, dude. Couldn't just let me have it. Oh well. It was my own fault. This whole thing is my own fault. Oh. This absolute meme of an idea is like now something I'm gonna commit myself to doing. I don't think I'm gonna. Okay, never mind. Gotta love that extra base HP, as well as the potion. Okay, well I don't think we're gonna make it out, so we gotta go this way. Okay, there's an elevator, and at the first sign of danger, we're gonna use it. Which is right now. Sense danger. I'm out. Thirteen hundred for- we have one more ore, and then we can get the uh... And then we can get the level 3 shot. Hey, Harry, what's up? You come to watch me play a video game incorrectly? Ah. 
do that. Oh, there we go, potion gulpers. That's good. That's achievement progress. Ow! Ow. Then again, though, like, if it's not my first playthrough of something, when do I ever play a game correctly? Like, name one instance of me playing a game correctly that isn't something I've finished already. Hell, sometimes I even play games incorrectly when I haven't finished them. Like, I play a game and I'm like, this game's too easy, I should make it stupid. It's been a little while since I played it. Like I was, I was kind of on and off with it like late last year for a little while. It's been like at least a month or two for me too. Oh. It's been even longer since I've uh, since I've streamed. It's been like two months since I streamed anything. Uh. I guess the only other path is this one. The path of least resistance. I'm dead. It's not even like salt. I'm just. I'm actually just fucked. Or not. Okay. Well. I, I, I don't know how I got myself out of that one. I'm gonna be honest with you. What the hell ever, dude? Let's go. I'm not gonna go for that die. I can't. Not in good faith. Okay, well, um, hopefully I find an elevator or else I'm screwed. Or like the exit that it works through. Because that will in turn lead to another elevator. Ah! ah. Alright. Run around these silly little insect dudes. Exit, exit, exit! Damn it! There's no exit. No. I can't escape. Ah. My son. Ah. Oh god! Ah. Oh god! Oh no. Uh, by the way, in case you didn't read the title, I, I, can't, I can't attack, so there was absolutely nothing I could have done. <laughs> if you're wondering how I got to level 3 without attacking anything, I'm wondering the same thing. But uh, apparently, the Scarab of Retaliation has some funky properties with specific enemy attacks. And fuck, dude. can't do it. I just need one more ore. And a bit of money. And some, like, kind of good shop RNG so I can get one of the two required items. One of them being better than the other one, but the fact that there's two that'll work will decrease the amount of time this takes. Also, if I could somehow manage to get, like, the anvil eventually, that would require killing the second boss. So I don't see how that's gonna happen, but, uh, man, that sure would be neat. Ow. There we go. One ore, let's go. 25 ore. Here we go. After about an hour and a half of playing, actually it'd be more like uh, two hours now. After about two hours of playing, we can get. Oh, it's only it's three common and one uncommon. I've been scammed. I thought it was two uncommon and two common. I've been scammed. 
okay, well, uh, that's not very good. <laughs> I don't know what to do now. I guess, um, how many, that's gonna take a while. I could do War Trader again. I don't know, I don't know how I'm gonna route this out. I don't think I want any of this stuff for a little while. I might just go ore trader because then we can convert golds to ore faster and that seems like it's one of the best ways of getting income. Fountain would help, but probably not as much as you'd think. So yeah, I think I'll just bank it to 30. Also, I probably have to go after another hour or so because I got work tomorrow. It's a thing. It's a whole other thing. All right, let's go. Hmm. Hmm. Ow! Ah! This is uh, not looking very good. Probably should have just banked the Yeah, I think I should just bank the money I have, if I am even still able to do that. Oh yeah, I can. I'll be alright. Can I get out and use the and use the well for the achievement? No. I can't. You should get a different computer. Sell sell your Mac. You don't want that shit. Then you can do stupid challenge games with me like this. Ooh. Ooh! I can't wait to get another experience boosting monolith that doesn't matter. Ah! We got protective powers. Okay, that helps a little bit. Man, a ten percent chance to disarm enemies in the primary that I can't use. What a what a great item. Actually, just dead. I have three health. I have three health. <laughs> ah! There isn't a way I survive this, right? There just there isn't a way. There isn't a way. Even if that's a, even if that's an elevator, I still get almost nothing. All right, screw it. Let's go. It's not. I I took more damage. I'm dead. Desktop for gaming. Okay, that works. That's kind of what I did last semester, but now this computer is literally just like strictly better than my laptop because it has it has a camera and a uh, and a mic like the laptop did, and like the old computer did Ow. not. But now it also is just like it runs faster, it has more space, and it's just here. And it, it holds a charge much better, because obviously it, it isn't a laptop, it's just here. The laptop dies after like two hours, I don't know why. It's pretty bad battery life. I probably did something to it, so 
I use it a lot when it's plugged in. And uh, I feel like you're not supposed to do that. But whatever, it's fine. Just grab that. Ah. Oh jeez. Well, this was a mistake. There's an ore in there, guess how much I care. I don't. I'm not gonna be able to get it and get out alive. Gold fever. Oh cool. That's definitely gonna matter when I'm about to die. So grab the ore, grab the ore, grab ah. the ore. Ah! No, I've been slowed. Oh. 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 Okay, please. Please, elevator. I've never needed one so badly in my whole life. I've never needed an elevator so bad. Oh, thank you! You actually gave me it this time. Thank you, oh great RN Jesus. Is this a pac a pacifist run? No, not quite. Um, I can't attack, which means all the, all the primaries and any skills that inflict damage are banned. But, but. It's not going to be in the shop, but if it is, wouldn't that be great? It's not. But there are items like, um... Like the Cape of the Flamewalker. Like it, like, it just passively damages things. Stuff like that is allowed. But no primaries and no, um... No damage dealing active skills. But if I got something like, um... Okay, I'll just show you. You probably remember a lot of the skills, but uh, if I got something like this, this is fine, because this is not capable of dealing damage to anything. So this is fine, but all the other active skills are banned. All the passives are okay, but obviously this one doesn't matter because I can't use the sword, and this one doesn't matter because I can't use the sword. So the, the, the eventual goal is to play as Priest, because Priest has the little magical orbs that, that orbit around him at the uh, at the higher ranks, and those passively deal damage. And that's like the best source of passive damage I'll be able to start with. So the end goal is to unlock Priest and level him up enough so that way we can get that. And in order to do that, I'm using Paladin to farm resources. Because Paladin, out of the five starting characters, Paladin, Ranger, Warlock, uh, Sorcerer, and, and Witch Hunter, Paladin has the most health and the most armor, and it's not like any of them can do anything anyway, so Paladin's the best choice. Purely because of his pure tankiness. Ow. But uh, we're gonna swap out a Paladin eventually. Once we, uh... Another thing I'm trying to do is I'm trying to rank up the guild, so that way we get bonus ah. stars. Because with the bonus stars, I'll be able to get the, uh... I'll be able to get the priest abilities quicker. As opposed to having to level him up, which is obviously very difficult when you can't attack. Ow. And the only reason my my uh, my current paladin is at level three, almost oh. level four, is because I got one of the retaliation items, and I think it's broken because it doesn't say it provides evasion in any form. But I was just constantly evading attacks, 
while still proccing the, like, retaliation damage thing. And then on top of that, I was able to get the item that makes beasts drop, um, HP items sometimes. So I was able to heal myself even if I did get hit by, like, ranged attacks. Because, like, all the ticks were not able to hit me. Like, I would just evade them 100% of the time. But the ranged dudes were still able to get me for some reason. I don't know why. I think the item is broken. Uh-oh! Uh -oh. oh! I bet none of your runs in this game were as stupid as this. This might simultaneously be the worst and best idea I've ever had for a challenge. Oh, that's not true. That would probably go to the Shovel Knight challenge run I did. Uh, oh, last year. I think it was last year. I'm pretty sure it was last year. The one where I played both of the characters at the same time and actually managed to beat the game. Somehow. I don't know how, but I did it. Oh, hey! The fountain! I'm gonna die. That's okay, because I got achievements. Or, like, progress towards achievements. <sighs> this is starting to get really annoying. <sighs> I don't know if you could tell, but uh, doing the same thing over and over again for two hours is not the greatest idea. But uh, I better get used to it, because I'm going to be doing this for a lot more than two hours. I think I'm actually just screwed. I'm, I'm definitely just going to die here. This is not even a point in trying. Oh yeah, we still have a thing of Shovel Knight! That's right, we didn't finish that yet. Oh hell yeah! 25% cheaper to buy items in stores, oh man. Because A, I'm going to make it to a store, and B, I'm going to have money to purchase things. Ah, yes, absolutely. To die. Uh... Here's a key. Some money. Can we go to the second floor? Should I go to the second floor? There is an elevator here, so I think I'll try to use that. Also, there's ore, so that just made this infinitely better. Okay, well now I think I'm just dead, so... Like, shit, I can try, but I'm, I'm probably gonna get caught. Oh, yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. Hey, the game crashed! I was wondering when that was going to happen. I sure did load a lot of floors there, huh? Gotta love the uh, take a break glitch happening. I mean, it's not that big of a deal. If I was playing the game properly, it wouldn't be an issue. So again, it is my fault, mostly. We still got, still got all of our progress saved. And now it's nighttime. All right, I think what I'm, what I'm gonna do is once I get the ore trader up, can you fucking not get caught in enemies, please? I think what I'm gonna do is once I get the ore trader upgraded, so like three more ore, I'm gonna call it because I don't wanna stay up too late. Hopefully I'll be back at this again soon and I won't take another two month hiatus. I guess it wasn't quite two months, it's like a month and a half. But still, it was 
a long and probably unjustified break. Uh-oh. How am I alive? How am I alive? Alright, let's keep going. Go to the next floor, let's go. And hey, there's another ore. I wonder if I'm literally just dead. Oh, look at that! I literally just died. At least I can buy a 29th Thor to make myself feel better. Uh, I definitely do have a couple more ideas for Wizard of Legend. Like, generally just viewer builds would be cool. Uh, if I could get around to streaming more races with people, that'd be sick. If I streamed JSAB, it'd probably only be like once. I'm dead, right? Oh, yeah, I'm dead. Oh well. I also kind of want to stream Dominion, because no one does that, and as a result, I'd be the most popular Dominion streamer. Ah. Uh, okay. In on it, oh my god. Dude, what if the imp gives me three ore again? What if? Wouldn't that be something? First I gotta find the little bugger. He's probably like way the hell up here. Yeah, he is. Oh my god, dude! Level 4! Hey, that's another way you can get experience. You can just get it from the imp. I'm gonna be honest and say I completely forgot that that could happen. Look at the swarm of bats. If I get caught for even a second, the swarm's just gonna eat me. Um, next floor, I suppose? Ah, there we go. There's our last four. And level four. Uh, stuff opens up on Tuesday, right? So we could do it Tuesday. Because I think Monday, they, they're still closed. Stuff is still, like, uh, not available. Okay, or Trader. And now, and now, since our or Trader is so spicy... We have the privilege of getting ore for only a thousand. Yeah, Monday's family day. Also that. Okay, so I think now the plan is to go general store, then go into uh, unlocking priest and uh, getting the guild hall up to tier 4 because if you have um well here hang on actually I can uh, I can check how many stars we have it should be 6 to my knowledge it should be 6 stars I'm gonna delete this guy right after I check this but it should be 6 it's 3 it's three? Did I not rank up twice? Could have sworn I ranked up twice. I guess not. Okay, it will be six eventually. Okay, it's 11.30. I could go another half hour and still probably have a good amount of sleep. Ah, what the hell, let's go.
I'm gonna need to stream this a lot to get it done. Might as well, uh, keep going. Well, I got someone in the chat to keep me company. By the way, I am almost certainly going to die. Ah. Ah, no. Nope. Okay. I don't know what I should uh, focus on next. I guess, yeah, just the store? Maybe, but upgrading the store another level doesn't really do anything. I think it might be better. Oh, really? You're gonna make me hunt this guy down again? Oh, two ore. Dude, that's sick. I think it might be better, actually, to um go for Priest next. Then go for Guild Hall. And then after that, kind of just see where it goes. Like, you're gonna have to roll the shop until you get the ability to level up the priest. But then once you're at Guild Hall 4, with the, uh, with the priest's orbs ability. Ow. You uh, you should be good to go after that. Ah! Oh! I got greedy. Temple. Moon temple? Moon temple, huh? Is that what you're suggesting? I've thought about trying to use the other campaigns, but uh, I don't think it's going to help very much. Ah! Ow. Ow, that hurt. No, uh, I, I don't think the Moon Temple is going to do very much. Because, yeah, I, I can get money from it, because the, the, the Pyramid, I'm going to tell you straight up, is not going to do anything. Because I, I won't be able to send down any of the money I collect in the Pyramid. So that's going to be a big problem. But, uh, the temple has elevators, but I don't think they're frequent enough to, uh, to help. A actually, you know what? Here, here's why the temple wouldn't work. The temple locks you in and, like, forces you to kill enemies to progress, and I can't currently do that. So therefore, the tower is my only choice. That was some nice deductive reasoning. I can't do the Moon Temple because I can't kill things. Unless if I have, like, spiked boots or uh, maybe this scarab again. Oh my god, five ore and there's, a, there's a, an elevator. I, like, absolutely have to bank this. I'm not going to risk it anymore. Ah. Uh, this could be really bad. Ah. Ah.
Oh, sick. That doesn't count for EXP or anything, but nice. Hey, I made it to the boss! I can't win, though, so I might as well just die. After uh, depositing my cash, of course. <laughs> Alright, 5 or. Good start. Uh, I don't think Echo's gonna be able to do that. Cause she's had some, like, uh... Ah. Some... Ah, oh, fuck, I forgot to use the potion. Oh well. She's had some, like, personal stuff to deal with. But, like, in the future, absolutely. Cause as far as I know, she likes going to sushi. There's another ore. Should I get it? I'm gonna get it. Ow. I give I give everyone the right to tell to say I told you so if I get it and I die. Ah. Ah. Aha! I survived. All right, let's go. Onward. And there we go, I can bank it. Let's go. That's a spicy meatball. How am I not dead? <laughs> oh nice, a secret. That doesn't matter, but it's there. Actually, you know what? I might get Guild Hall too, because then I can use the healing skill on the Paladin Rush. While limited in, in, in how many times I can use it, of course, because my mana regen sucks. It will let me recover health a little. Which would make the Scarab a little bit more sustainable of a strategy. Oh my god. What, what is this? Ah! I got caught on the pillar! Hates anything sushi. That's dumper. I'm I'm obviously kidding, but dumper. She's now dead to me, but not really, because she's pretty funny. And as previously mentioned, if I if you're doing something for the meme, I can. Fully respect it. I mean, case in point, this garbage. Oh, it's another ore. What? Now watch as I get savagely beaten by these insects. Ow. Oh! That was really close. Don't get locked in the corner. Don't get locked in the corner. Ooh. Ooh. Oh god, oh god, oh god. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Oh, that made me really uncomfortable. Ah! Oh, this is gonna be really bad. Oh, I don't like this. Maybe I can make it to the boss floor and I'll be able to bank my money there. Dude, let's go! 
<laughs> I made it. Let's go. Uh, that's highly inappropriate, and I'm going to have to time you out. Okay, so 10 ore. I can upgrade the guild hall, and I'm going to do that. Because I'm going to have to do it eventually. Guild Hall. And then with all these fancy schmancy stars I have. Because apparently I'm level 4 despite not being able to attack. We're going to purchase Lay on Hands. And I guess I can also get the shield upgrade too. Dude, this is great. I can heal myself now. And this is 100% allowed. Because it doesn't hurt anything. Well, look at this, enemies. I can heal myself. I bet you wish you could heal yourself. Is this safe to do when there's enemies on your tail? Apparently it is. Yo, and now like mana crystals matter too. Man, this is great. I love this so much. Mana crystals matter. I can heal myself. Man, it almost feels like I'm not playing the game incredibly wrong. But of course, I still am. Ow. I can't just play the game well and correctly after playing it like this for so long. That would simply be a waste of all of the current mean ah. potential. Also, I haven't uh, I haven't set up a rule set for what I'm gonna do if I if oh god help me I do accidentally attack something like just out of instinct and I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna like copy a save over and then if I mess up I have to reload the last save yeah, that's what a lot of other challenge runners do with uh, with stuff like this. Oh my god, I can get a bronze chest? Ow! Run! There's no, uh, thing on this floor, right? I didn't see anything. Is anyone else gonna- I don't know. Not next week, I don't think. Oh, jeez. Well, there goes everything. Well, not everything, but enough of everything.
I wonder if I should ban the magic missile items, because I could technically proc them with non-offensive skills. I don't think I will, just because the magic missiles kind of suck anyway. And I don't feel like remembering that they're banned, so I won't ban them. Also, hot damn, I have a lot of money. I better not lose it all. To something stupid and easily preventable. Oh no. I wanted an elevator, not more money. Now I have even more pressure. 900? How on earth do you think I'm gonna make it for 900? Ow! Ow! Oh god, another ore? Man, it's really just piling on the pressure. Okay, I better not die, because this is a lot of money. 1100. Ooh. You ever get those feelings when your anxiety just cranks up to 11 for no good reason? Yeah, that's me right now. Oh god, please, 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 please. <laughs> I hate tra I hate the spike traps early game. Because they're just, like, later on you can disable them and they're not even, like, that bad. Because you have more mobility and stuff. But early game, they're just devastating if you hit them. Especially if you're not Paladin. Fortunately, I am Paladin, so it's a little bit more manageable, but still not really. I can get an item out of this. Hell yeah! Three more damage to the primary attack I'm not allowed to use. Man, isn't that a great find? Oh, yes! Yeah! Eat me! I don't care, I sent back 1248. Alright, I think we're gonna go for the, uh... The guild hall push. We're gonna push to guild hall level 4. Which will take literally forever. But that's, like, the current plan. Ah. Also, is a blood right there. So that's cool. I'm gonna get it, not because blood rights are any good, but because ah. achievements. Am I willing to risk? No! Oh, dude, I'm so done with this crap. Okay, can I just?
just get spike boots and then I can, like, make some real progress? Please? Nope. Okay. I guess what I'll do is I'll just check the store every time, see if one of the items is there, and then if it is, it's just frickin' go time. I think I'm dead. I regret to inform everyone I have died. Okay, I'll go for a few more minutes. I think I'll stop just after midnight. Hey! That's cool. 72.50. How close are we to get... Are we to, uh... Well, obviously that's good. 700... I've killed 763 enemies without even attacking. That's how much of a gamer I am. Spell cat. Oh, that's not gonna happen for a while. Uh, replenishers, that's getting kind of close. That'll happen. That'll happen. 7,500 points for that. A lot of this stuff is just going to be, like, grinding out achievements and stuff. Like, you can probably get pretty far in the achievements without having to do any real work. Or I should just bank it. Don't want to take that risk. I'm also dead. for me. Okay, we'll, un we'll unlock priests, and then I think I'll call it there. Cause th yeah, then it will be just after midnight. And I probably should go to sleep after that. But uh, thanks to everyone who stopped by. This is definitely going to go on for quite a few streams, as is evidenced by 
the very slow progress in this first one. But, in spite of how stupid of an idea this is, I hope it's at least fun to watch. It takes a, uh... I don't want to say easy game, but a game that could be more difficult than it is, and it makes it more difficult than it is. Oh my god, but literally, like, the... Wow. The die. If I hadn't grabbed the die, I would have been fine there. I didn't, like, accidentally attack anything, did I? Oh jeez, now I'm worried. I kind of panicked there. Nah, I'm good. I didn't attack anything. Thankfully. Sometimes that's how it is.
fucked. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? This is starting to get really annoying. Like when you have multiple runs that don't get anywhere. Just ugh. Well, that's good. Give, give me that. I'm probably dead. I'm alive. Okay. Please. Give me this. Please, oh great RNG gods, give me this. this. I don't like this at all. Now nah, we're fine. Just remember to keep your shield facing the right way and you should be alright. Okay. And then careful of these guys. There we go. There we go. Yes. Yes. Oh. Uh, it should be open, because we're going back into orange, which means that, like, basically everything is open with... with restrictions. Okay. Priest. There we go. And now... Let me just make sure, but, uh... Now our next goal is to get to tier 4 guild hall, so that way uh, this skill on the priest is the little magical orbs, and then that will provide me with constant passive damage, which will make this way easier. So we made some pretty good progress so far, I've been playing this for, okay let's see, you can probably tell me right, 2 hours and 11 minutes, yeah but that's excluding the time spent in town, so probably about 3 hours. And, uh, this is how far I got. <laughs> Pretty good considering I can't attack. So I'm gonna call it there. And I'm also going to make a backup save of this. So that way if I accidentally attack, I can reload from this point. So we're gonna clone this. And 23 is going to be our backup save, 22 is going to be the one we play on. And, uh... Yeah. I, I hope everyone has a good night. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Take care.